we look up at the sky. We behold the infinite stars. And we believe we are all alone. You're in for a treat. This is the equivalent of a juicy steak. Beans. Of course. Not bad. It's good. Eh? What did I tell you? There's nothing on TV. Everything's still going. It's clever. No one knows what's going on. What do you mean? Well, there's no way of finding out what happened. Everyone's in the dark and people are clueless without information. It's ridiculous. Makes no sense. Isn't it weird? Everybody's going in the same direction. South. They're going south. But why? I don't know. Sarah told me people were saying it's safe in the south. How do you mean safe? I don't know. Less attacks. Get out of the don't worry, we're safe. How do you know? Are you worried because we're indoors? Don't they get angry if people go indoors? It pisses them off people go inside anything. Sure. But the trick is to know when they're coming. How do you know when they're coming? The sound of screaming gets louder. Have you heard about what happened in London? The attack? It's more than an attack. They're saying it's some kind of outbreak. Explosion. Not even two blocks from here. What's happening? I don't know. Just stay there. I'm coming to you. I'm leaving right now. Hurry. What the hell? Get out! <laughs>
what? I don't see anything. Concentrate. Look. Those eyes literally walked straight past us. They were this close. That could have gone very differently. Yeah, we were lucky. David, what are you planning to do next or go next? Fine, Sarah. I hope you find your mom. We need to go. talking about? Who will find you? Ios, infected ones. They taste the blood. They're looking for me. No one's looking for you. Now calm down. Stay here tonight. We should be safe. How's your hand? It's just a graze. And stop leaning. Cameron. What the hell? What happened? Why were you freaking out back there? It would be better if I didn't tell you. I think if we're gonna stick together, I have a right to know. You have to promise you'll believe me. Sure, I'll believe you. But I wanna know. Yeah. Okay. Everything that's happened is not what you think. There was never an outbreak. Those things were never infected. They've been controlled. 
What do you mean controlled? Controlled by whom? They're being controlled by very dangerous people. They have done all of this, taken this whole planet to find me. To find you? Wait. What do you mean taken the whole planet? Well, they're not from here. From Earth. They're here now. So, these dangerous people there... I don't know. Aliens? Okay, aliens. This is going a bit differently to how I thought it would go. And these aliens have come all this way to find you. Yes. Wow. And they're looking for you because... Because I'm not from here either. So, you're an alien too then? I've been hiding here on Earth for seven years with my tender. My mom here. Because of the war that the people who have come here started. I'm not meeting her down south. I'm meeting her at our ship. Your spaceship? Of course, well, a shit cam. You know, it's kind of hard finding one person out of seven billion people. It's a conundrum. You said you'd believe me. Well, I didn't know you were going to go say this. And the blood? The eyes taste the blood. They can distinguish between human blood and... Okay. Well, how do you think those eyes didn't see us today? It wasn't luck that they walked straight past us. I hit us. I hit us from them. You hit us? If I stand still and concentrate, I can hide from them. That's how they haven't found me. Do you remember I held into your arm? It hit both of us. I hit us, David. Okay, look. Get back.
You guys live so far from the ship. We stayed for about two years, but we were stuck in the middle of nowhere. Ellen wanted me to see your world. So year three, we moved to the city and started traveling. And then they arrived. That must have been insane for you guys. Yeah, we didn't know what to do, and Ellen wouldn't let me surrender. Surrender? Why the hell would you surrender? Well, look what's happened to your planet. It's all because of me. If I surrender, then maybe... Sure, but you didn't invade us, Cameron. You didn't do this. They did. I know, but it's still happening because of me. This is screwed up. talk to you about that whole surrender thing. It doesn't have to come to that. The thing is, if things get critical, yeah, even Ellen says I'll have no choice but to surrender. We'll just hide you till they give up and leave. <laughs> no, David. They won't just leave. They'll take me as their prisoner, or they'll kill me. But how are they going to kill you? It's a big place. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. What are they going to do? They'll burn the haystack. No. What do you mean? If they can't find me, Devonera will destroy the whole planet. This is the most stressful conversation I've ever had. And I've dated a lot of women. 
We need to cover more ground faster. We can actually make up a lot of time if we cut across that mountain. It'll be harder. You okay? I will be. Okay. Don't worry. We'll sort this out. billion dollars I could not pilot this vessel. Human? Yes, I named him. This beast reminds me of Pegasus. It does not fly. You will not understand this, Des. You are a machine. The Venera is requesting an update. What should I tell him? Tell him I'm shopping. De Venera, you summoned me. I'm fairly certain I was clear in my instructions, Garabon. Why are you on the planet? I'm exploring other worlds. Besides, I made a glorious discovery. Something the humans call caffeine. This is no time for sightseeing, Garabon. Erica. Should you not be terrorizing the Asians instead of obsessing yourself with me? I'm ahead of schedule. In every stage of this operation. So you found a boy then? <laughs> no. But don't forget, this is your operation we are following. Yet there you are, berating yourself on the planet, risking our exposure to the humans. I made it quite clear. Human? Was a weak cause. Someone whose sheer voice drains the life from you. Damas? We should have destroyed this planet and returned to the war. Ericol, you are being a dumbass. What is a dumbass? Enough! Find out what a dumbass is. What is our progress? The human controls have been testing the blood. We will either find the boy or whomever he is traveling with. It's just a matter of time. With all the destruction the human controls have inflicted, the boy could be dead already. We allowed the controls to summon the Blue Spheres, specifically for protection and diversion. Who knew they would want to blow everything up? Including themselves. 40 of their days, Garabon. That is all the time I gave you. We will have the boy by then. <laughs> Walking. I'm sorry, but I'm not a horse. I'm designed for short distances. I think we can rest here. I'll even carry one of you. But ladies, we are literally walking across a freaking country. I'm done walking. I'm going to check that house for food. I'll go with you. They'd better not stay indoors too long. I 
had another bad dream about Cameron. Oh, Ellen. I'm so afraid something terrible has happened to him. Oh, sweetie. In situations like this, you just have to have faith. Faith he's okay. You're a good woman, Nance. I'm glad we found each other. Ah, oh, me too. You're next. And then your friends. We have a hit. More are coming. Find the exact location. Sending coordinate control for location scan. You stay back. Don't touch me. Put this stick down, old woman, or you'll make me angry. You think that will stop me? No. But this will. The woman they discovered is on this continent. She is not human. And the boy? He was not with her. We have sent more controls to hold her for interrogation. No, she serves the boy. If he is not with her, she will die before giving him up. I will make her take me to him. You were going personally? I would send human, but I fear you will blow her up. Fire her up! Stay nice. Controls to the location. This is not something we can entrust to the human controls. Let me do this my way, Devonera. Deep down, you know I'm always right. Just find me the boy. We need to see this as an opportunity. Divinera, commanding the power of the blue light. Now Nalsa Mathia sustains the veiling of our ships, hiding them from the humans. But it is his brother, Habiem Gahun, who is able to weaponize the might of the blue light. He maintains our hold over the human controls. We are harnessing their power to disperse the knocks from our three ships. Not many get to witness the little ones at work. We've modified these knocks to test the blood of the people letting us know whether they are human or not. Have you sent them all over the planet? No, dear. They were designed to inoculate the warriors during battle. They move as the warriors move. That's why we keep the people grouped together.
missing? Yeah. It's for when I'm not with you. And I'm missing you. Wearing that. Stop it, you're embarrassing <laughs> me. <laughs> Don't be embarrassed, you're beautiful. No, say something nice. Like what? Like, I don't know. I love you, David. I love you, David. This is awesome. This is awesome! Cameron, buddy, let's not try to let all the eyes know where we are. Dude, it's time to hide us now. Cameron! What, are you both insane? I'm talking about staying indoors like this. Are you both slow? Uh... Do you have any idea what they'll do if they find you away from the crowds? Aren't you away from the crowds? Oh, and another thing. I still want to know how you hit us back at the plane. <laughs> You're smiling. Why are you smiling, Cameron? Shit. <laughs> Sorry. You're just so intense. You're changing the subject. How did you hide us? The sunlight. At that time of the day, can occlude. Uh. Go ahead. Tell her. You mean tell her everything? She might as well know what's going on. Okay. Everything that has happened 
It's not what you think. There was never an outbreak. Those things were never infected. My mom, the one I told you about, she's not my real mother. But to understand the story, we need to go away from here. David. I love our life. Me too, baby. Never leave me. Never. Who they'll be. We're four women. It would be good if we could join your group. Look, I understand. We are stronger if we stick together. Okay. We'll meet you at the edge of the forest. When we get there, I'll give you the signal. Good. Stay safe. And Ellen, what's the signal? Okay then. Ellen? Hi Richard. These are my ladies. Hi Ellen. Nice Hi. to meet you. Hello Ellen. I'm Graham. Hi Graham. Nice to meet you. Ellen. that have come for you. Maybe they'll give up and leave. Leave you. They're not that kind of people. No, I suppose not. So, everyone here is looking for someone? Of course, aren't you, sweetie? <laughs> yes, of course. Uh, my dad, Devon, he's an unpleasant man. Dreadfully annoying, but what can we do? And we have to live with him day after day after miserable day. We have to love them no matter how horribly old they are. It's harder for the older generation. They fought wars to keep the world safe. And then the world changed right under their noses and they didn't fit in anymore. Granny B. 
I don't know you that well, but may I say, you are quite delightful. Thank you, Graham, and I think you're a dish. <laughs> <laughs> Well, laughter keeps us sane, I suppose. It sedates all the worrying. You and your son were separated? Yes, Cameron. Where do you imagine he is now? Well, I don't really know where he is. But you know where he will be. That's the only thing keeping me sane right now. We had a plan in case we were separated. A place where we would meet about two days from here. Well, two days is not too big of an ask. That's cutting it close, Garibon. I'm just going to have faith that he's OK until I find him. We should all try and get some sleep. We've got a long day tomorrow. Yes. We need our rest. You still up? Hmm. A storm's coming. I like it when it rains. I wish I didn't have to leave. Me too. Looks like it might rain later. I do too. But you should not go alone. Oh, I have to. I mean, everyone's trying to find their families. Eventually, we're all going to head off in different directions. Look, I know I'm not going to find my father. He's already up there somewhere. No, Graham, Shane, don't say that. The point is, I will go with you. I will help you find your son. So where exactly are you meeting him? Uh... Over there! Those hangers! We should find food and water. Chocolate. I hope they have chocolate.
are attacking me! Call off the IOs chasing the woman. Do it now! She still has not told me where the boy is. Are you hurt? Huh. Are you suggesting you do not allow this to happen? Don't be foolish. It was your decision to masquerade as a human. These people are supposed to be under our control. Have the controls been called off? They have pulled back. She had better not be hurt. Don't let this happen again, Devonera. Find who allowed this to happen, and don't let it happen again. And take my son! Graham? May I have a word with you? Of course. Graham? I'm sorry to ask you this now. I've got to find my son. Too many people are dying. I thought I could do this alone. But now... You said you would help me. Please. I don't know what else to do. Of course, Ellen. I will help you find Cameron. Two groups. One has an age-appropriate male. What do you want to do? And test the blood of the boy first. Bring him to me. Freaking machine guns. Damn, don't move. You gotta teach me how to do that. Let's just get the hell out of here. Got him. He's down. 
That should be it. What? That's insane. Who the stuff was that? Come on. I do wish he had succeeded. I'm still searching for the one responsible for Garabon's attack. A truly shameful act. What is shameful is what I intend to do to them when I find them. Of course. We await your firing command. I don't know. I thought he'd be here before I was. I don't understand. Maybe he is hiding. No, he'd come if he heard my voice. Cameron! You said he would be here. Uh, I don't know, Graham. Maybe he's... Maybe? I don't want to hear maybe, Ellen. I'm sorry if I upset you. Looking for this? Garabon. You are insane. Yes. Search this area. Check for any life forms. All of this is because of you. This will all become ash because Kamira was not where you said he would be. This is all because of you. You have killed everyone. Me? How many people have died for this cause? This obsession? There are casualties in war, Ellen. You know this. This is not their war. The moment you landed your ship here, it became their war. Turn to your ship, Garabon. I'm here now. Give me time. The boy should be close. Return to your ship. Prepare for my fire command. 
Listen to me. We have been on this planet for 40 days. Give me a few more hours. I am commanding you to return to your ship. You will obey me! It's out of my hands. We can go up there and I'll surrender. What? What do you mean, we? Well, if it doesn't work, you won't die down here. Wait. Huh? What about Shauna? Cameron, if this doesn't work, it won't matter. Come. Your son, Ellen. He is everything to me. Then I am truly sorry. For you will not survive this. Spaceship.
long will it take us to get there? Just a few minutes. <laughs> this is insane. in distress. I don't know. They've never reacted this way before. I need control of them to fire the cannon. They are still can't form despite this disturbance, Devonera. Whatever is happening to them will not affect your command. David is still falling. <laughs> oh, my shit! Pull up in the controls! Hurry! is aligned, the cannon will fire. All this time, and the prize is within your grasp. The prize being Kamiru. Better he lives as your prisoner than he dies in this genocide. Stop this. An entire world is about to be destroyed. You fill my head with chaos. We too are fighting for survival, Ellen. My world is dying because Kamira's father refuses to save it. He is quite prepared to let my people die. Forget using Cameron for a ransom. Domerian is old, unyielding, and stubborn. Garabon, Cameron summoned the pure light. 
he is succeeding his father. The Vortex is alive. Prepare to engage the firing sequence. He can save your world. Returning to the planet. David, you threw the ship. <laughs> I crashed the ship. What's wrong with you? I don't know. I called the blue light. Yes, you did. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Something's wrong. I don't feel good. That's the blue light. You did too. Amazing. David, I'm so proud of you. David, the blue light's in you. This. Remember, they did. Cameron, the cannon. You gotta stop them from firing. No, hey, not for you. You quell blue spheres. Get out there and quell those old guys. The collectors. Stop them. Stop them, Cameron. You can save everyone. You can save. You can save Sarah. Save her for me.
contact Devanera's ship, we are no longer connected to the central grid. What? Hail all frequencies, including Ericol, and get me Devanera. What if I cannot make the connection? Then I will be dead, and you will be to blame. Oh. All Genins respond. Inform Devanera to abort the firing command. I'm Garabon's order. Stop the communication! I did, as you commanded. We are the only ones hearing this. Did you find the boy? I don't know. And the fire command? It is still active. Could it be? What about the message? Garabon is returning to the planet. Hold the message. Die in the blast. like this. The power has no limit. You will be mighty.
when you did what you did? Pulling spaceships out of the sky. <laughs> I felt you doing it. I, I felt the, the blue light lifting. I feel great. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. For what? For living. You're welcome. Now, dude, you need to go and find Shauna. <laughs> He'll be okay. I'll be fine. Go. <laughs> taking Cameron back with me. Am I a mother? That I would trade my son's life to save it? I do not know. I think a mother would do anything to protect her children. Certainly I would die for Cameron. And so this is the outcome of these years, hiding on Earth. There are different kinds of people in this world. Which one am I? I know who Cameron is. The one for whom the sun recedes, able to cast light on the darkest shadow. He saved a world today. It gives us tomorrow, another chance, another day. from the sky. We were fortunate to be so far away. General Garabon has secured the Maruan boy. Prepare your return course to New York. Garabon, you will return with me to my ship. Garabon, my mom, 
Allowed to stay here on Earth. You are a prisoner, Kamira. Enough demands. She cannot be in prison. My father will place no value on her. It was an act of love, no doubt. This was not farewell. It was goodbye. These moments together were possibly our last. I love you, Mom. I love you, my son. Come to him.
Thank you.